Hey guys, this video demonstrates the concept of counters in 8051. A counter counts every time whenever an external pulse is given to P3.4. In our hardware of 8051, we do not have a switch connected to P3.4 for the purpose of providing an external pulse. But we do have a switch connected to P3.2 for external interrupt 0. So what we do is we press the switch for external interrupt 0 and our counter counts. For that first of all we have enabled the interrupt external interrupt 0 by moving 81H in the interrupt enable register. Then to configure it as a counter we have given 05H in the T mod register and we move 00H to TH0 and TL0 registers. As you can see in the interrupt routine IN0I, we go on to complement P3.4 every time. Next, we move the value of TH0 to accumulator A and from accumulator A, we move it to port 1. Thus, whenever the switch is pressed, the LEDs which are connected to port 1 display the count value. So hey guys, you can see uh, I'm about to dump in the code which I showed you previously. Here is the XTAL frequency corresponding to your code. Make sure that you have created your hex file and uh, in the debug window, make sure you have selected the correct drivers and the correct COM board, uh, selecting the correct portrait for your board. Okay. And as soon as I debug, uh, whenever such a message comes, just try again. So you can see we are in the debug mode. And uh, as soon as I run the code, run on every toggle of the interrupt, you can see my counter counts 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, and so on. And now I will demonstrate the same experiment on uh, Proteus. Thank you. Hey guys, so I guess you enjoyed the video up till now on the hardware. So now I'll be demonstrating you uh, the functionality of counters in 8051, similar to that on software ISIS Professional. A so let's check whether the code is running or not. In the hardware, we were not provided with the facility of P3.4, but here I have added that feature. Let's just let's say save zero warnings and let's debug and check whether the code is running properly or not. So here I run the code as as 0 1 2 3 4 as i flip the p3.4 bit the counter increases on port 1 as you see so let's check the same on uh, proteus let's stop debug proteus make sure you have uploaded the correct hex file uh, counter dot hex okay place the leds on the port p1.0 p1.1 and the whole make it an 8-bit counter place a switch on p3.4 and as soon as you toggle the switch the uh, counter counts so let's check whether the thing works you can see the counter 8-bit counter working 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 and so on. So thank you. I hope you enjoyed the videos. Uh, if you like the videos, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.